Pe en sus pro league matches creo que no, pero sí también han sacado un buen de plays y mapas contra buenos equipos. Va a jugar mi KCP Alex, ¿Le vas a, ¿le vas a KCP Myers? Bunny se pasa, lo tiran. Uh, Rebel con la inicial. Páralo, páralo, páralo. Oh my gosh, esa con la que Increíble. Uh, estuvo duro, estuvo duro. Ese de Saos casi sacó la doble ahí. En lo que ellos estaban haciendo eso, ahora KCP tiene el geo. Mm, Dime va a morir aquí. Híjole, y dejó a Embar también. Creo que tiene... Um, creo que tiene dos balas de Embar. Son dos balas, sí, son dos balas. Mm. Va a estar bien difícil para Robo porque aquí tiene dos balas de Embar y tienen el nuevo Geo. Oh, pero ya se les gastó las balas. Están bien. De todos modos tienen setup aquí. Rebo con el retake, ahí lo jugaban perfecto ese retake, le salió. Hola Alex, eres el mejor, saludos, ¿qué onda Eric? Saludos papi. Ya se está acabando la apuesta o la previsión. Ya, ya se está acabando. Falta 50 segundos para apostar para Pique. Digo Pique. Para Rebel o a KCP. Rebel, they used the shot grenade to block off the back spine, but Crack couldn't win his strafe battle, and Demon will just choose to reposition for next, and I think that's the smart mm. play, as he's looking to put out a little bit of damage. Casi, casi era headshot ahí, casi. It's going to be Rebel with the swarm spawns and the height advantage as we move on over to P2. And then Pioneers, they usually leave it about 15 seconds left on the hill. That way they have multiple opportunities to break it. The first one doesn't succeed before the hill rotates over. They will have that second chance. And it's usually much better if you have the lead so you can go ahead and set yourself up for power weapons as well. But it's right now with a great start after two hills. Rebel, they put themselves in that driver's seat. Connects with an M-bar shot and they backtrack towards the hill. They know there's nothing to fight for, Blades. That's just the spawn point. They waiting for Pioneers to push forward and make that mistake. Yeah, and so we see how the pioneers are taking their time, putting themselves in a position in the top lanes before they can take this fight. And I want to bring that up because you guys, we were looking at the fight when it came down to Fury One and Team Queso's matchups, and we were very critical about how Fury One approached from the low side, and they didn't give themselves with that spacing at the top end of the map. Well, KCP, they're not going to make that same mistake, and it's kind of trading out this fight back and forth, and it's mm. Bronny on the no sé cómo le salió esa KCP. Pero le salió. Positioning themselves for this next hill. It is going to be a neutral hill towards the top half of the map. And with a well played shock grenade, you can not only buy time, but gain time Ooh. on the scoreboard as well. Okay, I dances don't lose these. Watch this. Watch what he's doing on the right. Uh huh. He gonna fake him. Uh huh. A little fake right to the left. Yeah, what? <laughs> oh, what? You know? <laughs> nah, you can't win them all. Was that funny as hell? I thought Danny was gonna win that 1v2. I'm not gonna lie. Off my left hand, I win those with ease. 
Now Demon with the M bar. Looking for his next target. Cracks guard in the top end of the stairs. Pero está bien, aunque perdió ese 1B todavía tienen control Demon siempre trae Ember, cada vez que veo Demon trae el Ember Creo que es la tercera vez que ya va Demon con el Ember aquí en esta mapa Frag from crack only to get some damage and back the players up in KCP, but they're just slowly but surely trying to take away the position. Shrack, crack to try on a nade here. Even after the shock disappears, there it goes. A nade. Ah, he forced them for well time. Frag grenade to play off the backhand of that shock and forcing his opponent to have to make a difficult decision to move forward or backward. Rebel. They'll get the rest of the time off the center line heel as pioneers as they're waiting for their teammates to come off respawn. They're gonna start putting themselves in the best possible positions for next. And you also see Rebel, they were able to have the foresight to know that play and they're on a the move as well. The battle's about to break out towards Fountain. It's Rebel with a high ground. With the high ground. KCP summons, papi, ya les dije, ya les dije que estoy esperando mi contrato, que ya, mándame la... Explodes con el flank, oh, mató uno. Oh, Demon, 18% de vida, Danny también one shot. Rebel Identivo, apenas me di cuenta que se cambió el GT. El Identivo con el Lembar. It's identifiable. <laughs> Played that one back a few times. No, they call us names of that, no. Soon, Direct TV gonna be trying to get him a sponsorship. Okay, he keep hitting shots like that. <laughs> Hell, you'll see him on every ad, promoting every football game. Now, nah, Danny está haciendo un montaje con el Lambo ahorita. Danny no está fallando. Not trying to get too overzealous, knowing that he made some big plays, but he's not trying to allow them to go to waste. They'll take a kill to the grave. Exploits with a little bit of help to take down Bronny. So far, Rebel has been in control. Mm. They were able to get two, so 3v2 is going to be the advantage that the Pioneers win. They get exploits down, so they're going to continue to maintain that advantage. And once more, as Demon does get. Hola, KCP tries to heal. Creo que si sí, Danny hubiera parado crack ahí, les hubiera salido, pero Danny traía un chingo de momentum, Tenía, sacó como 3 kills con la, 4 kills con Lambar Y quería sacar esa kill, so, tampoco, tampoco no es como que, es culpa de verdad Karen, Karen con el resub de 29 meses, muchas gracias Karen por tu, por tu sub, bienvenida, otra vez, welcome Muchas gracias, Karen. ¿Cómo estás? A ver, retake de Rebel, ¿cómo van? Ya mataron a... No, no les va a salir este retake. Pero otra vez, Rebel, Rebel va a tener el Lambar aquí. Year was good, Raiden. What's poppin', yo? Their opponent, they'll give up that heal and they'll start collecting on time on a neutral. Instead, okay, yeah. Rebel, the Rebel the tiene el heal completo nuevo. Lo tienen completo, tienen setup. Digo, no, lo trae KCP. Es pelea, oh, ya mataron a Demon. Going down is going to open up that opportunity for Pioneers to, to make a play for those frags if they want. But at the same time, if they don't know where the players are positioned at, they don't know where Crack and the M-Bar is at, it's going to be a risky play. So we're playing that one. Let me know, Raiden. Let me know where we got the smoke. Over the top, so they're gonna get the M bar. They're gonna get the frag grenade. Let me know that. Go run it up. Uh, I heard you, or I've seen you been on Halo. I don't know, you still be on Gears or nah? We've been good, brother. I've been chilling, G. I've been chilling. 
watching this pro league match right now watching some good ass gameplay chilling Quiero mucho te quiero también buzz como le salió ese juego a, a, a rebel en univ uff casi me acuerdo morir aquí ok increíble oh no lo tiró handle pero lo tiró brownie with 40 seconds left on his heel, they're gonna put themselves in a good position to collect the majority of this time as Demon's gonna get staggered out from responding with his teammates. Uh, they're going to worry. No sweat off their brow because even if they collect every single second on the side of Pioneers, it's still a massive gap. You see, he's just gonna let him get in towards the spawn. Crack knows he doesn't have the help necessary to fight this for now. In fact, oh, Identica's even second it. guessing. Identica's just trying to make it. <laughs> so, the ellos ya saben que está crack ahí. Entonces, so, que ellos saben que está ahí. By himself to grab that M bar and try to be a distraction. So this is going to be an opportunity here. He rebel to seal the deal if they don't know he's there. He has planned his cover so well. I love it. He saben, he sí, saben. Pero. He can see, but now the jig is up. He had to fight, but with the element of surprise, not able to do much with it. He's gonna cut in the inside. That's a body shot. Zaysho goes down, and that's a headshot. Nah, Danny. As he's able to pick up the second, that allows Rebel in the hill once again to start collecting on time. They can't win off of this one, Jacob. Yeah, they can. But oh, they, they are. They, they, they can, can win off of this They're one close. Bronny's down. I haven't played in a while, but I still be down. Play with Kenny, not Mongo. She was actually fun. Nothing like Gears. You're talking about Halo, right? And it's some deep spawns coming out for Rebel. Sorry, for the Pioneers. So they can do this. They just got to win one... This next team fight and it starts with D. Oh, yeah, este punto ya es de, de Rebel. Tienen, tienen Envoy todavía. Ganan con estos y capean todo. Ya solo les queda un push solamente a KCP. Oh. That's not much, Blaze. The Pioneers cannot get content. They need to continue to be on a roll here. Look at the mini map. Find outward. Yep. Three, one, and two. Okay. Exploits, Crack, and Ident is all rotating on over towards the spawn. They're not going to slow down. They're going to get into a fight with Handles. They see them. They lance mm. them up a bit. It's some damage. Handles will Aquí ya be tiene position. KCP tiene los spawns. Creo que Rebel trae una Shock. No? O nadie lo trae. You're trying to compete in this upcoming major. We'll see, Raiden. We'll see. We'll see, man. No sé. Esto es muy Charger. Está bueno. Está bueno el match. Dime va a cortar aquí. Va a morir Dime aquí. Sí. Ya, esta, este juego va a ser de KCP. Van a ganar esto. Oh, un down. Danny? No. Danny? Oh. And they will be able to keep everyone alive with the revives. And they will start to spread out. Yeah, this is looking scary. This is a lot of points right here. 60 point hill. They could come back with this. And they got Embar too. A must win hill for them. They need not worry on the side of Rebel though. They compose as possible. I'm not saying don't contest. Oh! You need to know you have more than a cushion. The plane is my big. Brawny. Brawny. Ronnie saves the day, put a cape on him. He's the hero right now for the Pioneers, but... Mm, the you want to go next, girl. The Rebel want to go next. Yet. Just that moment. She want to get hell? gets those frag grenades. The only weapon for Rebel to use with 16 seconds left to go. Oh, no, yes, it's done. have to go hill after yes, hill. Yes, it's done. 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 That's the moment. That's the moment right there because you see everybody trying to stretch forward to the top side of the map to where the neutral hill is going to be. Ooh. But Demon catches Sideshow slipping. Now. Oh. Catches Demon slipping. It's a 3v3. The hill change. They got a son on eight crack. Look at the kid on an eight. Todavía. A cell is trying to take over. Get him mobile with the M bar. Look at my nade. Ah. Behind enemy lines and a cell finds another headshot. Says, you know what? It's my time to turn up. What the lag? That look laggy as hell. The cells retired? What do you mean retired? This man is going to war right now on your screen. Oh, he didn't get the kill? Oh, no. Oh, baby. Not like this, right? They, they close this out. But they are feeling comfortable for the first time in a long time. 
No mames, si aguantan, si aguantan todo este juego completo, van a perder esta mapa robo. No tienen ni, ni armas para hacer retake ahorita, no hay ningún arma en la mapa, no hay shack, ni ember, ni granadas, nada. Puro, puro shot y puro lancer. Último momento, bro. no, no, último momento. Si pierden este push, todavía les queda otro, pero estaría bien difícil. Aquí están bien, aquí está bien Demon, si contesta está bien, lo van a tirar yo digo Estamos stuns aquí ya, estamos a... oh no, tienen la primera kill, tienen dos kills Demon Oh, oh esta pelea la gana Rebel Salió a Zeus Uh, big kill Pero yo creo que ya Uh I love it, I love it. Rebel con la primera mapa de control. That shit was way too close. Very close, but the boys over at Rebel closed it out. Demon the MVP. Can the pioneers tie it up? We're about to find out. Se lo lleva Rebel, se lleva la serie Rebel, yo confío en Rebel. Buzz, Buzz, muchas gracias por esa sub regalada. Thank you, Buzz, for that gift of sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Leyenda Buzz, I appreciate that. Rebel, salen con la snipe aquí, se salen. Tienen sniper, van a ir por el arco ahorita también. Pero creo que el anillo está arriba. So this is where it gets scary for Rebel, and if you ask me, if I'm Rebel, like the way they just got these power weapons, I think they need to go back up top. They need to figure out a way to not turtle down low. Like that's the thing is, I understand that the hill is going to be probably center, and you got a great spot. You can spread out. Nah, I think the hill's up top. I'm pretty sure first round is not up top. Yeah, it looks like Reb Rebel's going to try to go up top right now. I honestly think Rebel has to play for the high ground a bit going into this later fight, but. They're, they're very patient with keeping the mid-map open because they still got the nades, the snipe, and the bows. And if anyone from Pioneers want to cross this open terrain, then, hey, they're going to be in for a lot. They're going to be in for a lot of firepower. I don't like to question too much because these guys are some of the best players in the history of the game. But I would like to see Exploits go for more opportunities. You kind of put that bait out there, whether if it's Demon or if it's Identives. Let them move around, get them shot at by the Lancer, allow Exploits, one of the feared snipers this season, to begin to go to work. But it's 18 seconds for overtime. Body shot hit on the handles. Everybody moved out of that location. Oh, the hills on bow, uh, the bow actually. I'm tweaking. I thought it was up top. They don't gotta do anything. They're chilling. What? That was crazy. Lancer got a snipe too. Oh my. <laughs> Imagine he cracks the other guy in the hill. So the the play there, um, we saw the pioneers try to orchestrate. Hey, get a, you know, get a last second sniper and you know try to make some kills and a spawn happen and just hit our shots. That's the best play they could come up with. But we also saw them as the numbers were shifting there for rebel. They almost tried to take a two v one and spawn. They tried to isolate a few players, so they were. Being very proactive, but Rebel, they hit their shots and they had a good defense. A la verga, que pedo con ese wey, que pedo, no? Se rifó. A flash goes out. He can't get the pick up. It was an early stun that forced him back. But can he go forward again? His teammates... No mames, ahí valió verga mi demon. Ahí está en el piso tirado. GG's. I'm already trying to utilize that advantage. Sending ourselves down low to try to get those frag grenades. He's going to come back up top. Mataron a Bronny, va a caer Danny. Daisho puede morir aquí, no, no murió. Oh, no sacó la kill. Oh. Uh. For the pioneers, that one was looking a little scary. Zaisho, or to say, it sells, 
choosing to go down low at that moment almost cost them, but having the quick wherewithal to go ahead and advance towards the top, put that Lancer fire down, basically saved the day. It did, and it, it really Remember did, and they got back in time. Um, Rebel was quick on trying to make a move, though. You know, as soon as they saw him pick up those nades, they sprung into action, and they found themselves a kill, but they just couldn't get past the rest of the D. Now, Zaisho, a late flash, no snipes being picked up. Identus comes in at corre, 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 corre. Exploits got taken out there. Uh, Bronny, he couldn't get back, so he sacrificed his life for the team. Identus, can he hit the shot to make it a 3v3? He's trying to look low, but his real focus is Bronny. Oh, yeah, see, his real focus is Bronny. Trying to see if he can get anything, but I will tell you, if there's any player who I love watching with Snipe, I love watching Identus find shots. Is that sometimes what you got to do? Create a play. Cuatro contra tres, pero Rebel tiene todas las armas para clutchear esto. Creo que el anillo va a ser en medio aquí. Va a ser donde están um, las dos trocas. Oh, le dio. Oh, my God. Ese arco casi lo mata. Creo que no fue activa. Si, fue, si hubiera sido activa. Oh, sacó. Boku. Demon. He caught him on whole spot. No, no, no. He caught him down low on the flank. Now, this next hill, is it up top or is it in the middle on the cars? It may be in the middle on the cars. But the way that Rebel tried to press up, they maybe just... Sí, el hill tiene que estar acá abajo. That's a great bow to take ya tiene toda la posición, Rebel. No way OT is down low. If OT is down low, Rebel wins this. It is. I wish Colin was here. It's like... Yeah, right? <laughs> we gotta pay no, mm, ni de pedo, ni de pedo pierde esta ronda Rebel. Están esperando un sniper ellos. Tienen tiempo. Pero no, esta ronda no la pierden. Tienen un sniper y tienen un bow. Oh. 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 Risky play, and, and honestly, it looked like Rebel was going to do a job of taking that high ground right back. But no, sé pasó ahí. holding on to it to the very last moment before pushing. Vitalize, down. vitalize, guys, for follow. Thank you for the uh, follow. Vitalize, a lot of those ending fights just to cement themselves into the hill, forcing Rebel out to the open for some easy shots. But in, but in that hill right there, you have to play tire. Like, I probably wouldn't play away from the, the planters on the lower stairs. If you go too deep and spawn, that hill's in the middle. You ask him for a Mr. Crab situation to happen. Nades going up top. It's on the pillar. It's on the pioneers. It's not going to bounce back for the right kill that they need. But it took him off that snipe position. And Demon still has one nade to work with. He banks it off the back pillar. But he's going to twirl it. You can't be twirling at this level, big fella. They see it coming from a mile away, but they can't stop it. I get the idea. He was just trying to put it in a position where both players tried to roll out. Esa nade estuvo perfecta porque hizo con eso sacaron la primera kill. Ahora traen sniper. Jacob, you say some funny things, bro. I swear. And I love I playing off it. <laughs> but that one... I speak first and I'm like, what did I say? You didn't have a hope. Oh, Gilligan didn't have a hope whatsoever in that last round, you guys. We're all tied up two to two. Editing into the fifth round. It's going to be an aggressive sniper play coming out for Rebel. But Pioneers, they are ready for it. Look at all four Lancers uh -huh. focusing down the line. And they get the downs. They get out everything and so the why why did that happen why was it such a mismatch in the first 10 seconds it's called man on man empezando ya con los filetes con el baile damn se viene lo bueno 
Se viene lo bueno, chat. 3-2. KCP. No entiendo por qué KCPA siempre hace eso es, es parte del juego Tienen que entender, bros, que Los bailes, cuando bailan en el juego Es solamente el, del puro juego Depende de los jugadores y dependiendo del equipo Pues algunos equipos ganan confianza con eso pero casi casi nunca es como tan personal la verdad no tan personal pero yo nunca lo he tomado, tomado tan personal Damn. easy headshot Zaisho Emery también Wow, que no cayó. <risa> oh no, Crack hizo ayuda a Demon ahí y le volaron la cabeza. Aquí van a tener que empujar bien incómodo. Ya tiene el sniper, bien incómodo. Ah, Pretty good, my boy. Was good, man. I'm chilling, chilling, freshies. Uh, just here watching some pro league matches. It's probably gonna be the only one I watch today. Good match so far. These guys are probably gonna be tied up one-one. One-one map count. 
But you see how Rebel only plays one person on the line and they stack everybody else towards the back? Crack has a big job there to to really try to keep those players' head oh. down, but exploits My. off the rack. Go oh. <laughs> oh, to those threading the needle type shots. Body shots going to be hit onto Bronny. Handles get taken out shortly after. Hi, what's up, Vitalize? Ese Bronny no hace nada porque le baila. Es parte de la estrategia para que se tilteen y jueguen más con ganas de bailar con inteligencia. Pues sí, es parte del juego, como dije. No, no es nada personal, no es nada para tirar hey a los jugadores ni nada. Eso es parte del juego y es como dijiste, pues para tiltear otro equipo. He has such a big role dealing with Bronny and his cells. Puedes decir increíble, increíble. KCP se van a llevar el sniper. They're gonna get the snipe. They back out here with Zaisho. They'll reset. Bronny stays alive. Multiple downs. And that's one at the pillar. They're gonna try to move forward and take over, but they can't make the play. Bronny stays alive. Demon's taken out. It's a 2v4, a little love being shown mid-round. It's just the confidence of the squad. Wow. No nos van a dar un gear 6 hasta el... Hasta 2024, yo digo. El año. Uno, uno. Uno, uno en mapas. Se viene el Vazgar ahora. Hey, yo, what's good? The fusion? What's good? I feel you, and I still kind of do a lot of those. You know, when I was watching, sitting back, watching the show yesterday, uh, for sure, um, I got a chance I to see you, that bro. old, you. old video of uh, you and Colin 1v2 and me, but multiple for like 10 minutes and shit, <laughs> okay? I'm trying to get us on E-Days, me, The 10 minute 1v2. Sells. Come on, me, you, Kenny Sells, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna make it happen one day, all right? I will have the time of my life making call outs and rotating, playing gears, challenging fights. Like, ugh. I feel 16 again. But when it comes down to our players in our lobby, they're trying to bring the youth back to us with nothing but excitement and entertainment. As in our first <coughs> fight, it will be won here by Rebel being able to get that first kill and press up towards their opponent's home hill. But you saw that move from Rebel. You saw how they started the fight a second before they knew the Pioneers was going to start it. For them to be able to press forward, get that first kill, and, and set the tone of this. Now, once the dust is settled, it's Pioneers in a 2v1, but they started off to make a great play. Oh, yo. Oh, oh nah. my God. Oh, baby. God. Oh, oh my gosh, he, like, se oh, man, so he almost got another. I was just talking about how perfect it looked like the pioneers were playing that with so Papi, so the cover Be away like, from was good. Yeah. It's best of five, see, it's the match is best of five. Ahorita van uno y uno. El que llegue a tres mapas ganadas primero gana. Is in the driver's seat because if the third person didn't come, I think he wins the one v two. Like he hit a full spread on the on the player who tried the challenge. Now we move down low towards the tank fight. It's a 2v2. Zai showing Bronny up against Demon and Crack. As Demon and Crack gonna be defending against this B Hill. On the other side of the map, a sales and handles. They're being very aggressive against identive and exploits. They're able to take down identives and exploits will back up for now. Place is life. Still alive. No one challenging. They'll give up their home hill. But they will find a little bit more map control for a bit. As Demon's trying to push back Zaisho, he may be able to get a cross for his teammates. Instead, it's Crack who will get the cross as he's going to rotate back to try to help them flank this A-Hill. Where Demon's going to get pressured by Zaisho. They're trying to yeah, this needs to be a quick fight. All right, now he's in a 1v2. Ronnie knows he went off of respawn, so they got to make this quick, but they're going for the decap instead of the eliminations. Them taking this long is going to get their home mill decapped as well, so everything is going right for Rebel. They're also going to be that first team to eclipse that 200 point mark, so desperation is going to begin to set in for the Pioneers, knowing they have to go and win these fights, but no, they run past what? not one, but two this players run up past that right point, to, uh... who's now going to get across towards the side. Double down coming uh... through, and finally a sell steps up. Daniel va a morir también. Tres muertos. Último es Demon, 1v1. Tiene que forzar esto ya. Bronny va a esperar. Demon va a capear esto. Tampoco dejaría. Oh, no lo va a capear. Ya está la ronda choqueada. Ganó KCP. 
now exploits having to run into the hill oh a quick revive and a quick kill for crack he just needs to stay alive jacob he took two shots but plan his cover well but zaisho is being annoying in this situation as he holds his shots Bill hit the two that he need and his teammates can't come off respawn fast enough yeah crack needed to figure out a way to get aggressive but even if he did he gets that elimination how far can he really see he realistically stretch it with the rest of the members of the party? Hasta ganas de, ju hasta ganas de jugar, no más de verlos. Es entiendo, papi, te entiendo esa, esa motivación o esa tentación para jugar después de ver los pros y pro league. Te entiendo. Si Rebel pierde, me corta el pelo a la verga. Uh, te vas a rapar. He was trying to channel his inner dyslexic, but, uh, you know, ah, it just like didn't work out for him there, okay? Ronnie crossed out. He's going to be the first blood on the map. B-Hill goes in favor of Rebel. They're going to cut back, try to regroup, and get to the home hill. They'll have a cross from the other side of the map as their teammate captures B. They got that pressure. Pioneers know it, so they back up right away. That kill gets cleaned up on Demon. I think that's a blunder on the side of Rebel. Now they're gonna lose crack as well in the process. Everybody's just kind of running around in different directions like cockroaches when you turn the light on, and that's gonna be the thing to hurt Rebel because I don't know what's going on in the PR. Team oriented as possible. They're trying to chase down these players that got behind their enemy lines, and that's gonna be identives first. They find him out, and look at in your mini map. They're just going ahead and get as many points. Buenas noches, Simons. ¿Cómo vas, bro? Todo bien. Todo bien, Pekka. Aquí viendo el match Rebel contra este KCP. Pues nada, papi, aquí tranquilo. ¿Tú cómo andas? ¿Ya viste el clip del Game of Witcher en Twitter donde Assault dispara tres veces seguidas? No. No, ahorita estás hablando del clip ahorita en el match de Clock Tower. Sí, estuvo medio lado, sí lo vi. Estaba como se la guió ahí. Zaisho trying to take one to the grave. Yeah, he had to his Lancer there. You see how weak exploits was. He almost came away with the kill. Yo lo mataba si no, si tenía otra bala de Nasher. Well, the the Regency? Ah, no. They got their opponent's home hill, but not for long. It's two separate 1v1s being fought. Handles and assails both of them 1v1s. And handles wins a 1v2. He threw a 360 Why is player 5 not on the hill? Oh, he didn't, he didn't go for it. I must say, bro, that's a trip gap domination if you want to play for it. Just waiting for his team. Look at your mini map. They're gonna give up the home hill of C, making that rotation across. Demon sees that one coming. Probably gets Mark, the ball out. Play for the but late the player's game. fresh off of respawn. He's just gonna be unable to stay alive. Exactly that. Pioneers know the situation. They know exactly what to do, and they're just trying to back off. You see them going off that neutral. That home hill of Rebel is going to be free. They're playing more for rotations instead of straight elimination. See, the reason why I'm not pro is because once I see my teammates win 1v1s on the mini map, I'm like, okay, cool, it's my turn as well. <laughs> Let's go. You know, I'm playing for the win. <laughs> like, oh, if I lose, don't worry, you won two fights. Ronnie trying to defend against his left. His teammates are being backed up on the right. A team kill comes through for Zaisho. He's regretting it in the moment. Ronnie goes down. Zaisho with a little bit of extra Lancer fire. He does a great job pushing back Demon. He'll get this kill without any problems as he was also getting oh, flanked at the same time. Trip cap domination. Oh, you got me? <gasps> tocó? Nullified for now. Como tocó? Oh my god, that was crazy. How did he get a touch? Rebel tied up. They need the they need the cap as well. Did they change the wind condition? Oh, that's, actually, that's actually that's actually broken. He got a con uno todavía. Got a con uno aquí. The two v two fight up top is being won. The one v one is being won down low. Can one hill get decap? A capped in the last second. It's the pioneers finding the wind condition that they need. Increíble. That's that's just a nail biter. That's a nail biter. Um, a ver, aquí está el clip. If they would have just put pressure on him while capping it, he doesn't hop over, he doesn't get a ver, a ver, aquí está el clip. Donde Sao dispara tres veces, a ver. Hay que verlo. Ah, sí me acuerdo, no era Clock Tower, era en Regency. Sao matando con Embar, saca Nasher. Sí me acuerdo, creo que se lagueó el stream o él. Mira, uno, dos, tres. Sí, está bien lagueado este clip. Estaba bien lagueado porque hasta el audio, al audio, el del juego, 
Retro Lance was being placed. First blood. Eu também está muito feio com essa. Goes away of Rebel. <laughs> Knowing that they have the 3v2, they're going to try to get the home hill, but we know how difficult this hill is. The hole in which KCP having a respawn. Yeah, that's a little sus. They're going to be slowed down. Well, they're going to wait till their teammate come out the respawn. Then they're back on offensive. It's Rebel who has to back up immediately. A dense is maybe overstand as well. Come exploits wide with the Lancer angle. He couldn't get the last down that he needed, and that is going to be three. Players spectator cam is always sus. You can't really like. Uh, it's very different as spectator cam and then uh, like an actual player cam. So far is looking good for him. The actual player point of view is very different. This is a quick ass three cap already. Oh, that was a good touch. That's a good touch. That's a good touch. Oh. Oh, he didn't chunk him on the right. I thought he got that chunk. He did too. At least the trade. I thought he at least got. Yeah. That would have been a great, great moment in time for Rebel. But minute and seven seconds. That round, the quickest one so far. Off the back of the Pioneers, opening strategy. You can kind of see it. Rebel got aggressive. They decapped the hill. They were pushing forward, but they pushed forward too much. And that was the moment. The damage was there. He mm -hmm. saved just enough. One Lancer bullet would have got the down, but unfortunately, it was yeah. the tables being turned on the Rebel squad, unable to survive in that moment. We'll it's see shot grenade. Good shot grenade getting upgraded. And Jacob, too, the way that that play is designed, too, is like, because if you get that first blood off the start, the way Rebel gets it, it's a quick cap, and then you back up. You just want the lead. Okay, and you want to force your opponent back out into the open and have to decap that hill because you know they're going to get their home hill because it's the closest. Rebel got too confident, and honestly, they were about if their focus fire was better and they could have got one down in that fight, they'll probably win it, but they don't. And we'll see a slower round going into the fourth as we got some shot grenades landing towards the back side of that tank. It's going to stop Rebel from rotating around. Pioneer is looking to press up momentarily to get this B hill captured. The home hill players swap off their fights and they go for flanks. They no hills cap. Los dos están flanqueando. Brownie flanqueó el equipo de Rebel y Demon flanqueó a KCP. Pulls out the shotty. He'll be matched up against the Sales in a 1v1, but the Sales goes back to help out his teammates. He finds exploits, but that's not until after his teammates go down. Both these Aquí players tienen pinched. Hola. A retro lancer on the right. Crack. A lancer on the left. You see Hasta him trying to snipe. He goes for the power weapon. Was it the right play? We're about to find out as the sales goes down. Crack hops the cover. It's a 1v1. For control over the hill. And it's the pioneers who get back to it in time. Ok, pues ahí ganó la pelea de KCP, literal, esa inicial la ganó KCP. Demon agarró Snipe, pero la guardó. So no, hay no hay Snipe ahorita en el mapa. They want to get these two hills underneath their control. There's not much Rebel can do about it. They still had Crack off of respawn, but with Crack coming back up, you see where the shift in momentum is coming up from from Rebel. But they get a little ahead of himself. Identive gets taken out, traded out by Demon, who's doing all he can. Reinforcements are there, and this is their chance to take a 1v2, but Demon going down. Crack's getting the revive. They need a bait and switch and getting this hill ASAP. Can they get him? They're trying to. Doing their best as Sea Hill's getting decapped for now. That's a 1v1. That's a 3v2 at the home hill in which you're watching. Candle's only job is to stay alive, but he finally goes down. And it's his teammates who are still able to find some more kills. Rather than crack running away there, he goes back into the fight. And that was a bad move from him. He got accepted. His teammate died to get him out of that situation. Trying to take a page out of Exploits Paybook. Deacon is caught out though, making it harder for everybody else. As boys on the other side of the map, making his position known. Hearing that call out, you can see what that's doing to the defense. That's going to force Zaisho back on over, just in case that push does come through. That's Rebel forced to wait that extra time in order to get their player back in, so they make a 3v3 push here. And this push is so important. Make or break for Rebel in this round. Crack is going to go down. Demon's going to be there. Aquí ya. KCP ya ganan con uno aquí, con un heo solamente. Pero se están encerrando. Oh, oh. Oh no, you wanna put exploits? You wanna put exploits? They still have that win condition with one. And they're able to catch a few players chasing them. Getting that kill on crack. And they're still trying to hunt down this kill on exploits. He was trying to rotate back and get that sniper off the respawn, but he can never get into an open position. Pioneers are just breathing down his neck. Rebel is trying to formulate 
uh, a, a, a team fight here to, to, to retake these hills, you know, when a pioneer at least had his home hill set up and they can't get it done. Crack trying to save his teammates, like, get off him. And they like, get, off <laughs> he said, get off my man. Bro, the round's Leave over. him alone. <laughs> Leave him alone. <laughs> at least trying to get the doubt. Something. Four to zero. They need something, Blaze. They need milk. <clears throat> Boy, PR said they need milk. They already put that big weapon down. Leche. They don't win the battle. I almost want to see them put another weapon down on the other side of the fight and force pioneers to kind of spread themselves thin, but then that would also force Revel to spread themselves thin. I don't really know what the answer is here. I don't know what it is here for, for Revel because maybe you put... Well, see, that's the thing is, you're behind on your weapon placement by a lot. You at least need a second weapon down. They're going to get the bow tight. Identis is really good when he's able to pick this one up. Puts out a lot of damage. They're also gonna have to play this map fast and chaotic. Uh, if they keep playing it, if they try to outsmart pioneers, try to play their structure, their play style, they're definitely gonna lose one of these last five rounds. Rebel needs to think outside the box, and they're doing that just. Oh, salió. They got it down. Se salió. Corre, Danny, corre, corre, corre. Deja exploits. Deja exploits. Deja lo. Backing out a little bit more. The snipe shots are connecting, but no one is able ah, to tiro de the los pallets. numbers on the left. So Danny Corre, no. Identives, and he can't even make it back. He's going to the grave. That sniper was out too as well. That's going to go into the hands of one of the... Bulltog versus Bulltog. Yeah, I don't even know how Demon put himself in that position. He just kind of rolls into two players. We've got domination for a moment. Rebel getting toward heal. That's going to be exploits. And you can always see Azels. Every member of the Pioneers who find themselves in no man's land are just slowly backing up, playing into that well oiled machine. Because they know something's not going to be taken without sacrifices. You see flash grenades go ahead and stall. Identive goes down. He's not going to be revived back up. Exploits goes down as well. Crack's going to fall. Three players down and out. Make it four as Demon gets shut down. That's going to be a triple cap domination for the Pioneers who end this match perfect. Five to G G over Rebel. Cinco cero. Absolutely dominated there to get control of this series. One of the fastest Vascars that we've seen in a while. And Excel with a heavy backpack. 16k damage, 11 assists, and 17 kills there. There goes the torque boat. I show you done for the squad. That man is not only the slaying powerhouse, but the torque boat as well. And it sells, look. Están al revés las fotos A ver Ah sí, qué pedo que sí Cells es Danny Crack es Handles El Pig es Daisho Mira nada más A Danny Oh ya lo están cambiando Ya lo están cambiando but if there's one thing we know, I think we'll definitely get these deep spawns, yeah. And you see how they came in at the mini-map for both teams. And, ooh, Rebel wins the, gets the last kill on the team fight, though. Now, Pioneers, they're not too upset about it because they got the line oh here. Oh, my goodness. And even if Rebel gets all of it, he don't get the lead back. Pioneers, they're playing nice, for the Nice, nice, thank you for follow. All lanes covered at the top end of the map. Dake up, thank you for the follow. Lanes. Gracias. They got the bottom side covered at green as well. All right, man. Let's see. Let's see. KCP, we got. They got the U Hill set up. Bonnie's gonna. Wait, I thought he got picked. Okay, he didn't get picked. Now he's gonna get picked. Uh, so four v three should be an easy retake for Rebel. They got numbers here. Forcing a full rotation from everybody and another opportunity as a cell gets connected on and the splash damage is there. Crack gets one onto handles. Zaisho's trapped. Definitely going to get taken out. Whoa. But he gets one before dying. That's good. That's great for pioneers. But what they do from here on out is going to show was it worth it? Was it enough for Zaisho? Was it enough for Zaisho? I I think that. That was a great kill for him to be able to take that one to the grave. And that player that respawn maybe a little bit towards mid map. Regardless, this is a 3v3 and a 1v1. There's someone behind all you. 3v2 going towards the hill for Pioneers. It's a 2v1 mid map for Rebel. They're putting all their focus on trying to take down handles in the middle now. They finally aren't able to get that kill. They'll move back towards the hill to try to help their teammates. This is the big revive. They need to double, and now they need to get the kills on the other side of cover. They can't get it just oh, yet. Mamas. 
¿Qué está pasando? ¿Ya ha perdido Rebel? Nah, todavía no ha perdido, todavía no Todavía falta mucho Es que da, es que da literal el mapa completa Two players down low. They, they're gonna have to make a play soon because if not, it's KCP. They're gonna take their numbers on the front. They're, they're gonna try to play for the three v two if they can. That's a great bank on that nade. Keeps a player in the corner, but yeah, he was just out of the splash range. That was a great angle that Rebel took to avoid the nade. Two back A's being missed, but Exploits connects with the melee up close. Crack having a backup. He takes one down with him. The three vibe and the cleanup is there for Rebel. But it's Bronny in the hill looking to take a 1v2 after already taking a 1v2. Rebel darts back for the respawn. But Bronny, he's relaxing with the lead. As he's going to dart four for a kill. Cut back to the spawn. He's taken out. But he set his team up really good. As long as he put out that damage there and slowing down this Rebel roster. Making that push could have came through a lot quicker. A great flash. Identity to get stuff short. Quick revive there from Rebel, though. It was finally going to be contested. Zaisho takes the brunt of that damage, but the bait and switch to perfection. That allows the cells to pick up two eliminations. Bronny gets one, and then they have that last player trap dead to rights on the hands of Crack. But look at him just bouncing no, around. Mames. Que no puedo matar crack. Tasmanian Devil. <laughs> Stealing away that time, keeping an end out of the hands. Andaba sacando los moves ahí, crack. Simultaneously allowing his team to get that rotation for this next hill. Great plays, great plays by him. Nades in the hands of exploits. Handles with four bows. Three bows left, gets a little bit of splash damage. He lets his teammate know that they can move up. They got those players hurt. Any, any little bit, any little bit of little bit of damage they can get on these players going into this fight is going to be crucial two bowls left that's a great connection there a sales will get taken out as well as zai show handles got one kill but he has to back down because he's the last one left alive two bowls left and his teammates behind him that's a great connection from him on exploits inactive in the chamber he gets taken out right away demon looking for a double kill but he's unable to find one Bronny finds one of his own. It's going to be a 3v2 fight in favor of the Pioneers. They should be able to get control. He's a little over aggressive there. Losing a couple of players that they possibly shouldn't have. That's going to be a sell to drop last. Bronny putting on the show for us. And a couple of nations on this hill. That extend the Pioneers' lead even larger. Double down coming through. A flank just the next time from Handel to save the day. Nobody dropping out from the Pioneers. And they're not only going to get that scrap time if you look at the minimap. Taisho spreading over from next. He's trying to get that next spawn point to keep it out of the hands of Rebel. Man, he's done a good job doing that. Nate spawn in 30. Bow is in 20. Rebel will be set up for next as well as the new bow. This is the best setup they can get on this side of the map, preventing anyone from going up those stairs. But you see the flashes and the smokes in the hands of the pioneers. They're going to try to initiate this fight now. So in case they do get a kill, they can press forward and use their numbers to get the bow. And they use the last bow that they got left, not on the right edge of the cover. Demon may have moved a little bit too. Los dos traen un bow. Bueno, ya se le acabó el otro bow. Creo que les ha ya no tiene. Pero Rebel sí trae bow. Pioneers are on a 94 to 14 run right now in this game to kind of get that lead but big downs coming through it's actually going to be trades back and forth between both of these teams crack pulls out the torque bow gets the splash damage kill onto a cells demon identities find that one onto zaisho like i said it was much needed 94 <gasps> to 14 run what push came through absolutely needed and success came through for rebel it's just in the time Oh boy, Rebel. Oh, Dime, I'm worried. Dime, I'm worried. They finally got some success to try to stop the bleeding. The Pioneer has been having a lot of success in this map. Exploits with a great cross in the middle, takes down handles. He's going to move up to help the rest of his team. It's a 3v3 fight on the hill. No angles from him there in that position. Crack moves in to contest. He knows he has to fight. It's a decent shot in there um, on the players on the stairs, but he had he doesn't have that extra help in the middle that he needs to 
be able to come in, get the revive, or clean up those kills. It's the Pioneers who's going to win that battle as Rebel. They're going to drop all the way back and start playing for Sacrifice. Start playing for Res. Back information, but... Oh, I thought he was going to two shot down him right there. That was close. Hey, it was popping Jay. Jay with the resub. A little bit on the offensive here with a 3v2 advantage. Side show spawning up. 23 months? Baby girl? 23 months? Michael Jordan! Thank you, Papa. Thank you for that reset, man. I fucking love you, bro. Thank you, thank you. What's good, Jay? What you up to, man? Oh, nah. Didn't get the memo from Zyshow. So that's going to allow Rebel to get a good portion, a good start on this hill. Oh, man. So, it did get Rebel off to a good start. They need all this time to get this one tied up, and I think they're one team fight away from doing it. <laughs> it starts there. They're gonna have to dodge these bowls, but I don't like if Pioneers lose, you know, a few more players, two more players or so. They're definitely gonna be rotating towards that next. Oh, Sai Show with the save. Demon almost made a huge play to take down a bowl player and Zyshow. He's gonna have to rely on his oh. teammates to get the job done. But it's pioneers who are slowly able to get the kills, move into the hill. That's a miss bow. There are two times, two times that the one that has arco wants to pick the one that is winning the grenades and they fail. How much time is left there? It's about 20. Could it be a glitch? But the pioneers didn't get all of that. 22. I think that rebel's trying to contest for the scrap time. But they get not one, not two, but three eliminations and that scrap time. That's a good fight. They're forced to rotate for the next hill, which is they're actually going to beat them to the punch as well. They need to take that top positioning over the top, spot out some players, and depending on what pre-fire damage you get on them, you either stay or you try to backtrack. But it does look like the pioneers are going to try to split up the defense and try to see what they can get. Mmm. Sales got too happy, got focus fire. Zyshow is in a one v two. He's doing a good job on his own. Both him and his sales to the respawn. Ronnie and Handle just left in the two. 30 point four. game pretty much right here. To contest this hill. Even when Nade's falling behind them. This next hill is big. Alive to <sighs> not give up too much time and they will take one to the grave. 2v2 on the map I think. Is it 2v2? 2v2 fight. That was, that was a good kill coming out for uh Bronny before he died then because that set up oh, oh, my God. oh, 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 oh. whoa a quick revive Bronny's back into the fight but demon will stay alive there identis makes the play no capitan the king of latin america really shows why he's still wearing the crown to this day and trying to take the number one place for latin america on his own and it looks like in a few short seconds here rebel will gain the lead over the pioneers who don't want to let that lead go too far as identis finally gets taken out demon's gonna fall crack needs to save these torque follows while backtracking for this next hill because they conceded it on over to the pioneers it goes but they're only gonna get scrap time oh, oh boy, team kill. a team kill from exploits brody's still down as i show and the rest of the pioneers could get the revive and they do this is looking like a meltdown at this stage in the game yeah, and especially in this late game, that is a meltdown. They're not able to rebuttal and get the kills that they need to. Player 5 is going to be left by himself at the mid portion of the map. I think they saw him a second. Yeah, Cell saw something. Saw the tassels on his head move a little bit. Pioneers are fortified. Rebel trying to play in from the low side of the map at Nade. Going super wide. Demon gets surprised. He gets angled out. He's the focus of attention. I show with a beautiful angle there towards the mid map. It forces Rebel to have to play into Handle's hands as he's backed all the way up to the spawn, having to dodge the nade. The heal is contested, but it's the pioneers who are exactly where they want to be. Rebel can't get Jesus, this shit is looking like a horde match. Just holding down Lancers. The team fire is just incredible, Jacob. Up until this point, Rebel has been doing a good job. The last three hills, they kept them 26 points, 25, and 12 respectively in game by the pioneers so this is going to be a big hill for them to collect time on and recollect that momentum oh no, what the hell this is the shot identity gets two demon took advantage three players oh. down and out and make it four those are big points big humongous points match. game changing points right I, there i did not think that was going to happen but <laughs> it's like 
Andre and said in chat that this is constant war, okay? And that fight right there just proved it. Oh, Me so that's where I show. Up in it. <gasps> they oh. don't want to give up a foot. They don't want to give up a mile. They don't want to give up a... A ver. What? Okay, it's a replay, y'all. Yo, it's the restart. And we'll get the scores updated for you on the left side of your screen. Creo que con la pura inicial ya gana gana KCP. Damn, ganaron four wipes, three wipes, no más murió uno. And that's gonna be pioneers getting these power weapons and now starting to set up on this. I don't even know how many points they need. Not much in which they need it, but Rebel needs to be quick and they gotta dodge these power weapons as well. <laughs> I was thinking that same exact thing. They don't oh, have the time to wait, and that's going to be a window of opportunity as Demon takes out his cells, but they're spotting him out. Somebody else has to open up the door. Three players are trying to bull rush. The hill is going to be contested for now. Frag grenades going out. Brody still has that torque bow underneath his control. Demon, did he get spotted out? Is my question because he could be a sneaky force to be reckoned with. And no, okay. he does get spotted out. Okay. A cell literally oh, retook that hill by himself. Okay, oh, poor piece. One, but a cell completes the hat trick and controls the hill. They could win off of this hill, Blaze. They could win off this hill. They need 54. And it's gonna have to be Rebel who has to quickly get back into it. The flashes are going down. The shots are there. It's a sales who's going big. He's looking for the second kill and he's gonna get it. He gets the third. The Jesus. shots in the fight. Jesus Alejandro, yeah, he's GG's. Take this series three Damn, that's wild. G fucking G. I had to watch that again because I didn't even know that they replayed it already. Uh, big play. Pues big play. KCP. Play. GG's. G fucking G yo. Alright, stream, YouTube, muchas gracias a todos los que estuvieron aquí viendo este video reaccionando al match de Rebel contra KCP. Hey, this shit is rigged. Yo dije que iba a ser un 3-1. I did say it was going to be a 3-1. Parte de KCP, like, Jesus. Like, ¿qué dije? ¿Qué dije, chat? Nah, pero estuvo bueno, estuvo bueno el match. Muchas gracias a todos los que estuvieron aquí conmigo viendo el match. Este, nomás les pido, por favor, dejen su like, dejen su like, comentario aquí, y pues los veo en el próximo video. Appreciate everyone watching this YouTube video, man. Hope you all have a great rest of your night, day. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video, man. Peace.